Hey you guys, what is up? Welcome to my channel. I am Holly Lenora and I hope you guys are having a safe and happy holiday season, staying healthy, safe, you know, all the good, all the good stuff. I know I am. I know it doesn't sound like it. My voice is still still kind of croaking but we're gonna get past that we're gonna move past that because i have a few of my favorite things in front of me um i wanted to do this for december that doesn't mean that it is released or has been released in december it just means that currently in december these are like my go-to's my reach for constantly whether i'm doing glam or natural or just want to kind of you know not look dead these are the things that I'm reaching for. So let's hop right into the video. If you are new, what's up? Happy holidays. <laughs> Ooh, happy holly days. Are you guys tired of the holly jokes yet? Holly jolly holly days. I'm not. <laughs> okay, if you're new, go ahead and subscribe. Join my family, ring the bell, hit the thumbs up button, and let's get into the video. First things first, I wanted to get this out of the way. Uh, not because it's boring, but because it's not like beauty related but I did want to share this with you guys I have been looking deeply into mouthwashes why 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 Holly why Holly Jolly that's just weird because let me tell you as someone who works 12 hours a day sometimes freaking more um I have to wear a face covering that whole time for the most part you know I can step outside and take it off or you know, I get my moments to take it down, but for the most part, I've got a mask on. So I wanted to be kind to my poor little sniffer here and really research into mouthwash that would hold its fresh breath claim for a really, really long time. And this bad boy is it. Yes. Found him on Amazon. I think it was $14.99 for two. Not for just the one, because I would keep scrolling. Uh, $14.99 for t a pack of two. And this is the TheraBreath Dentist Formulated Fresh Breath Oral Rinse. Fights bad breath for 24 hours. 24 hours. So, um, yeah. It has really been nice to use this and, you know, I have to, I think we're all like smelling our own breath that is so gross the molecules ew anyways this stuff works out really well i have found it to be a great purchase mouthwash wise um amazon i will link it down below when you use it it does not like when it it goes through your nose like that burn that a certain like listerine that brand will definitely burn but this is actually soft it's a soft mint when you're swishing and then when you spit it out, you can definitely feel the minty, spear minty, feel it and taste it. But it's not, it doesn't burn and it doesn't have alcohol in it, I don't believe. No alcohol, artificial flavors or colors. No burning, looky right there. Non-burning. Amazon, $14.99 for two. I'll link it down below. Okay, now on to the beauty. I've got some higher end products and also some drugstore lower not lower end but more inexpensive products so first things first i want to go for lashes boom this is lash princess by essence they have two more and i've got the other two somewhere uh the other one is a blue waterproof and then there is a green one can't remember what that one does they each do a different thing of clearly the blue one does you know, waterproof this pink one is a volume mascara and this purple one is the sculpted volume mascara I double team these I use them both these are my everyday going to work put them on quick and still have long volumized lashes they were $4.99 or $5.99 I actually saw a big bucket of them in my local Ulta I know you can get them at drugstores. I don't know if they sell at Walmart yet. I haven't seen them there, but like CVS, Walgreens, clearly you can get them at Ulta. I love them. My only problem with the green one was I have, or I can get oily eyelids like throughout the day when I'm at work. And I noticed wearing that one, I am really not sure about my hair. It, it's fine. Um, wearing the green one that the mascara would rub off 
on my crease bone and that's just not a cool look. So I stopped wearing that one, but these two do not do that. I wear, but I combine the two. I put the pink one on first and then go with the purple and beautiful lashes and they last all day. Doesn't flake, doesn't come off on your upper lid. So these guys are definitely in my favorites for December. I love them and they are inexpensive. Next product is a brush. This I got from Target. I got it a long, long time ago. It is, I'm so sorry. I cannot remember what SK stands for, um, but I slept on this brush after I got it. Like it just kind of set in my brush bucket. And then I was baking one day and I picked this up for some reason and felt it. And it's, it's a great buffer like to take your brush and buff your bake off as well as blend in your contour or your bronze and just give yourself more of a flawless airbrush look. This brush is great for that. It just blends everything so smooth and it's got that right amount of density to buff everything together and it's got enough I don't know, it's just not as fluffy and as loose as other brushes can be. So Great job buffing, great job getting off of that bakage. This was a really good find. It was at Target, it was inexpensive. All the products that I'm mentioning, I will link down below. And I'm very sorry that I can't remember what SK stands for, but good job SK. Next product, this is a little baby sample that my friend Alex gave to me. Love you, girl. Um, this is the Ulta Beauty, Ulta Beauty Matte Eye Primer Focus. Oh, thank you. Matte eye primer. It is in the shade Nude. I love this stuff. Samples are the best thing because clearly I've tried it. Now I love it and I'm going to go buy the full size. Good job marketing Ulta Beauty. A little bit goes a very, very long way. I'm talking like not even a pea size. How rude. Okay, I'm back. Not even a pea size. Put it on your finger. Pat, 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 right on your lid. Rub it in. I used it today. Clearly you can't see it, but um, I used it today and it holds on to your eyeshadow like nobody's business. To be as inexpensive as the Ulta Beauty brand is, I mean, this stuff is like the Urban, Urban Decay Eye Primer Potion or even the ABH Eye Primer, which is pretty expensive and it's really, really intense. Like it's like a white color almost. This is a nude. I'm not sure what other shades they have. But this is the one I have and I absolutely love it. Definitely made it into the favorites. Inexpensive and works well. I love when we find products like this. Thank you, Ulta Beauty. Next product is a blush. I'm wearing that blush right now. You can see the sheen and the shine. This is from Lawless. This is their Make Me Blush Velvet Blush. This one is in the, sh in the shade Sakura, Sakura? S-A-K-U-R-A. This is what she looks like. She is beautiful and it, there's a sheen and a shine to it that I absolutely love. You can see the shine right there. It is beautiful. I am constantly reaching for this blush. This blush and then the Rare Beauty, that, I think I have that one in the shade Pinch Me or something. It's another really, really baby soft pink like this guy. Um, the only thing that I have with the Rare Beauty one is, it's not hard to blend in, but you put on like one little dot and you're rubbing it in like around your eye. Like, would you hurry up and blend? It's beautiful, but it just kind of takes, it takes more work than it, than the Lawless blush does. I have another shade in this too. Like this has been my favorite blush of the year. It is beautiful, goes on like butter and leaves a beautiful, just like pinky sheen and shine to your face. Love this stuff, made the favorites list. Next product is another face product. This is from Dior. I have had this on my Instagram stories, Facebook stories. I'm obsessed. This is the Dior Glow Face Palette and it looks like this. She is absolutely beautiful, bougie at that. I am floored at how gorgeous this palette is. My favorite color so far is this guy. 
it's just got that perfect amount of glow and shimmer and shine, especially for the holidays. So you just pat it on, or I use a little highlighter brush, like when I'm in front of my mirror. And it just gives you this gorgeous shine. Uh, all sparkly and holly jolly for the holidays. Oh my gosh, I cannot get enough. I'm sure I overuse it just because I like applying it and then looking at the shine and the glow. Okay, that's enough. But this guy is beautiful. She was pretty pricey. I can't remember exactly. But I did get it during the Sephora VIB sale. It's beautiful, great for the holidays. Be a great gift for not just any friend because she was expensive. But you know, a really, 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 really good friend. Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. This stuff is a dream come true. It's a dream come true. Your makeup is not going anywhere. Anywhere with this stuff. I pair it with all my foundations. It's great for if you have a glitter or shimmer eyeshadow, spritz your brush with it really quick. I mean, I don't know what is in this stuff, but it is magical. This is a beautiful buy. I'm so glad I got it. I will continue to purchase it. It is one of my top favorite setting sprays, no doubt. Hands down. And I felt like I needed to put in an inexpensive eyeshadow. This would make A, a great gift for your friend or, you know, yourself. I won't tell anybody. This eyeshadow palette is a collaboration, Morphe and Madison Beer. Ever since I got this, I, I'm pretty sure we've seen this pop up on my videos quite often since I made the purchase. It is inexpensive, uh, $22, $22. I'm not sure. I'll link it down below. You know the deal. These are the colors that you get. And let me tell you, they are so pigmented. This black right here, I use it all the time. It is gorgeous. The shimmer shades, this guy right here is beautiful for your inner corner highlight. This guy right here, if you have lighter skin, it's a great smoother for that brow bone. This palette, she really hit it out of the park, knocked it out of the park, did her thing, slayed the game, whatever you want to say. This palette, I use it all the time. I love it. The shimmer shades are beautiful. Perfect for holiday looks. Not too overwhelming. This palette, go get it. It's beautiful. I'm obsessed. Next up, we have concealer. This is from Rare Beauty, and it's a beauty, all right. This concealer blends like a dream. It is like freaking butter. Smoothest, creamiest. I have it on my face right now. I have been reaching for this nonstop, constantly. Mine is in the shade 230N, and this concealer has definitely made its way up to one of my top favorite concealers. The applicator is like this really interesting doe foot applicator, and it's like, I don't know, it's thicker and bigger, more, more pronounced of an applicator. I don't know exactly how to explain it, but it just goes on like a dream. It is so creamy and smooth. Like I can't at how well this stuff blends in. And I like to pair it with the Anastasia Beverly Hills setting powder. Flawless face, filtered face. That's what I'm wearing right now. And it's so, can you see how flawless? Not like me in general, not like flawless me, <laughs> but like how my skin just looks smooth, filtered. That is a horrible camera angle. So sorry, but I did want you to see my skin. Okay, next up, lashes. I have been wearing these lashes since I got them. They're so beautiful. This is the Lily Lashes Glam Collection. These are named Sis. I am wearing them right now. As you can see, they're not too dramatic, but they do add a really nice flair. Just enough drama, but not, like I think you got a caterpillar on your eye. No, they're not like that. They have a beautiful winged tip. I am obsessed with these. They are on sephora.com still, 
In the clearance section, they are half off. They are $15 and I'm telling you, I have worn these things, I can't tell you how many times. They are just so beautiful and perfect. Next, I wanted to add my current favorite bronzer. This guy is a little bougie. This is the Gucci bronzer. As you can see, packaging is super bougie. I mean, it's just, they did a, a great job on this packaging. Even the bottom is stunning, except for my fingerprints on there. This is what the bronzer looks like. That is beautiful in itself. It has a soft, soft scent to it, nothing overwhelming it's kind of a florally scent but like I said it's nothing strong too strong or overwhelming that you're like oh my gosh I'm gonna smell like this all day somebody hugs me and they're gonna cough because the this, this smells so strong nothing like that um, then you can lift up the actual bronzer and there is a little brush in here this um, no mm -mm. I do not use this I think it is I don't know, maybe they put in there, put it in there to like justify the price or something, but no, that brush is useless to me. Maybe some other people do like it and that's cool, but not, not I. Uh, this is the little pack that it came in. I don't know. It's like a velvet little Gucci pack bag. I don't know. I only keep it in there just because, I don't know, it came with it, but it is beautiful. When you apply it, when it goes on, it goes on smooth. I have it on right now. All my favorites are on my face. And it does have a touch of gold glitter in it. This stuff is beautiful. Okay, we are down to the last products. They are all lip products. So I will start with these bad boys. These are the Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipsticks. I have the shade Malt. I have the shade Naked. And then I also have the shade, what is this one? Starfish. Interesting name. These are all three. If you've been watching me, you know I have mentioned these before and I wear them quite often ever since I got them. I actually had them in my cart on, it was either Sephora or Ulta.com. And my mom and I were going through TJ Maxx. Of course, I had to hit up the makeup section. And guess what I saw? These guys, and they were $7.99 a pop, as opposed to the 20 that I was going to pay from Sephora also, whichever one it was. They are $20 there. I found them at my local TJ Maxx, $7.99 a pop. I was too excited, and they are so worth it. They are so beautiful. I'm obsessed. I'm wearing, let's see here, I'm wearing malt and naked on my lips right now as like an ombre lip. My favorite way to do a lip. And these two kill it. They dry down and they stay put. They are super pigmented. Like, go to your TJ Maxx before you purchase these from Sephora or Ulta or ABH.com because $7.99 and, I mean, they're beautiful. Or my next lip product is from Rare Beauty. She did a really, really good job with her line. She honestly did. Um, this is her lip cream, lip souffle, something about a dessert and creamy and fluffy and airy. Is it a mousse? Souffle? Something like that. Anyways, this is my favorite shade from her line of lip sticks, creams, whatever. This is in the shade Inspire. It is a fire engine red and it goes on like butter it is so beautiful and it stays put line your lips fill it in with this stuff and you are good to go and your lips they stay moisturized hydrated like right now i love this stuff but my lips feel not dry but not hydrated okay that's that's the best way i can put it not dry but they're not hydrated they're just kind of there they look good but they're me feeling them they're just kind of there these are, they're so creamy, so beautiful, so pigmented. Good job, Selena Gomez. You killed it. Is it okay for me to give an honorable mention? I want to give an honorable mention to this Sephora brand lip cream. This is a lip cream stain. Mine is in the shade 32. And this is 
the perfect shade. I didn't use it today, but this is the perfect shade for a beautiful nude lip or if you're like me and you like that ombre, line your lips with the darker color, do the outer corners of your lips, and then take a light shade like this or this one. Sephora, I think it was $14. Take off the excess and just pat right there in the middle on either top or bottom. And now you've got an ombre lip. Freaking beautiful, inexpensive Sephora brand. This color is absolutely perfect. It's beautiful. Okay, those are a few of my favorite things for the month of December. Of course, that's always changing the more I play with new makeup and you know, minds change, hearts change, makeup changes. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had fun hanging out with me on the floor. Had to film by my trees. I just felt, I've got so many Christmassy things in my apartment that make great backdrops and I'm like look I put these decorations up I gotta make all the use I can out of them okay okay if you haven't already I would love it if you would subscribe join me and my beauty YouTube family we are growing we are growing and I absolutely love it I cannot thank you guys enough for hanging out with me as much as you do showing me your love and support all my new subscribers you guys are rock stars you don't even know how much it means Thank you so much. I will stop blabbing. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I will see you on my next video. Bye.